That's, he could probably a slip in line. as well. Yeah. yeah, exactly right. Now, of all the uh, Australian Super Rugby sides, the Reds are probably the biggest unknown quantity in 2015. They finished 13th last season, but with some big-name recruits, they are, of course, aiming a lot higher this year. It's a season the Reds will forget in a hurry. It just wasn't their year. Yeah, we're looking on obviously improving upon our uh, year last year. So for us, that's a lot of hard work on the field and, and hopefully hitting the, the ground running. You know, from the Reds this year, you'll see a bit of a, you know, we're trying to evolve as a team and still be, you know, an innovative team, a team that entertains, but also plays to win. Um, so for us, I think, you know, we have made a few changes. I don't think we've been uh, short of, uh, you know, of uh, our responsibility back to the rugby public. But Car Carmichael's been with us now for the last uh, four months and has settled into the group uh, very well and obviously recently named uh, vice-captain on the side. Uh, James O'Connor back from his stint in France and, uh, and also with London Irish. And again, a guy that I think has come back uh, in a really good frame of mind and uh, ready to play some good rugby. James O'Connor, see what the Australians got in the tank, and that's a wonderful handoff. Look at that. And James O'Connor scored two on his first try. Yeah, look, I was fortunate to be able to play with uh, some great players and also be coached by some of the, the best rugby minds going around. Um, but to be honest, it's good to be back. Uh, it's a, a young group, but there's also some, some great talent and uh, some old heads in there that are... It's, it's a good mix, you know? It all depends on sort of how we put it together on the field, but yeah, I'm saying very positive. I know the, uh, the boys as well have, uh, you know, that quite confidence that um, there's big things to come. I've been a professional in, you know, in the sporting arena for 11 years, so, uh, you know, nothing spooked me too much. You know, I'm pretty confident in my ability and obviously my experience and experiences over, you know, the past 11 years that it'll hold me in good stead going forward. And, um, you know, I think we've got an exciting future. Karevi shrugs off the tackle, Charles. He's a decent player, this kid. Look, from where we've come from as far as having to start again and, you know, not having done as well, last couple of years, I think it puts us in a good position to sort of fly under, un, under the radar, you know. We have got a good group of players, but at the end of the day, it's about playing well together as a team, uh, you know, every Saturday.